Tonight, a bill that would give state money to historic African American cemeteries could soon become a reality. 8 News reporter Nicole Dantzler is live at the Woodland Cemetery to show us how volunteers there are hoping to use these funds. Nicole. Deanna Eric, two lawmakers are leading the charge on passing a bill that would allow African American cemeteries founded after 1900 to get state money for their land. Today, volunteers at the Woodland Cemetery searching for hidden gravestones. If I'm lucky, I'll find one. The historic African American Cemetery was founded in 1916 and sits along the Richmond and Henrico County line. For years, volunteers have cleared away brush and trash to revitalize the cemetery. John Shuck, the volunteer coordinator, says though they made progress, they still need volunteers and money. Every stone dug out is potentially another family member now that can reconnect with the cemetery. But again, all these stones we dig out are going to have to be maintained around, and that's what you know, the money with the bill would help. Senator Jennifer McClellan and Delegate Dolores McQuinn introduced a bill that would allow historic African American cemeteries founded up until 1948 to receive state funding from Virginia's historical African American cemeteries and grave fund. Now all these graves in here have sunken in. Shuck says money from the state would help to further research of the cemetery's history that's yet to be discovered. One gentleman came out a while back and looking for his grandparents' grave and took him over to it and says, wow, you made my day. No, you made my month. And the bill still has to pass full committee in both the House and Senate to become law. Live in Henrico, Nicole Dantzler, 8 News.